I'm just going to do a total. Um, I'm going to do the uh, the 15 volt total. So the TDA 7267 at 15 volt put out 0.6555 watts. The eBay LM386 at 12 volts put out 0 0.495 watts. The TI My Little LM386 at 12 volts put out 0 0.832 0 watts. The TDA 7267 at plus 15 put out 0.6555 ohm. Sorry, the first one for the TDA 7267 was 12 volt 0.5778 watts. At 15 volts, the TDA 7267.688.655 watts. The eBay LM386, the little kit there, that put out 0.8911 watts at plus 15 volts. And these little LM386s can go up to 18 volts. And my um, 386, the TA, TI version, Texas Instruments version of the IC, at 15 volts, put out 1.28 watts of clean, undistorted power. So yeah, that's, um, that was a quite good little experiment. Well worth the couple of pounds for the dummy load. If you want to see the other numbers, uh, this is my LM386. And then for the TDA. Which isn't bad really. And this eBay LM386, uh, it costs £1.14 including the shipping. And even though it's not a genuine LM386, and it does sound tinny compared to my one, it does sound tinny. Um, there's definite differences, but then there's differences on the components that are used. Um, yeah, but it was a great little, uh, great little experiment, great little test. Thoroughly enjoyed doing that. Uh, like I say, you know, what you got to use is the volume control on the amp, and you can get it to clear up and then just bring it in nice. Um, yeah. Not bad at all. Anyway, if you got this far, thanks for watching. And I'll speak to you again soon.